Hi guys, what's up? My name is Chris, and today we're not doing a tutorial. We're gonna take a look and do an unboxing and a setup of a few gadgets I got. Don't go anywhere. I'll be right back. Alrighty guys, so let's go take a look then. I've got a nice big box here from Amazon. Check this bad boy out. So let's go take a look, is it? I need my keys. Open this box up. I do could do I could do with a nice uh, pocket knife right now. Let's see what I got in this box. Hey, there goes all my stuff. All my money's gone over the floor. Lovely. That's my uh, zip gone. Just my luck, guys. Oh, a bit of comedy there, film. Seriously, such a big box just for a few, couple of little light tons. So let's go take a look what we got anyway. I have got a PCI RAID card. Right, this is going to go into my server and I'm going to set up a, a Samba, a Ubuntu Samba file server. So I've got that. So let's take this take out of the box and let's take a look. Guys, I've got no room here at all. Well, look at this, guys. Let's, 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 let's chuck this box on the floor. Give myself a better room. What's going on here? Oh, that's better. Right. Let's go take a look. Let's think of my cut like a sim. Alright, folks. So I have got some sat two SATA cables here. Along with the RAID card. So this will then go into the back of my PC. Uh, there's the connection on the side there. And we have got four SATA ports. So one uh, two there and I got two there. So this going to this will go into my server. Uh, I will have to make sure all my data's backed up and do the data migration from my computer to my server. We also have then a CD. So I'm guessing it's to set up a software. And what's this little thing? Well, it's just a thank you. Little thank you card there. I don't know if you can read that, guys. Still, thank you for, for, for buying the product. So, that is the SATA RAID card. And it says it supports Windows 98, 2000, NT, ME, XP, Vista 7, and Linux. That's what I need, guys. I'm running Linux Mint 17. 64 bit right here, and if you can read the bottom of that, supports 98, 2000, NT, ME, XP, Vista 7, and Linux. Brilliant, exactly what I needed. So I'm going to put that to the side. So the next thing I have here is a um, StarTech um, Mini HDMI to DVI cable. 
So I can hook up my third monitor. So if I just take, show you you guys. I got enough cable here. I got my third monitor here. This one is going to be hooked up. There's my center monitor, and there's my um, first monitor. So let's open this bad boy up then, and let's just take a look at him. Nice long cable. That's perfect. So you can see mini HDMI on this end, and DVI-D on this end. So this will be going into my, this end will go straight into my computer, this end straight into the monitor. Uh, then I, all i got to do is go into this, or onto the settings on my system and tell, and set the monitor up. So that's the other thing I've got. And one more thing guys, one more thing. So let's put this back in this bag. Check this out, check this out guys. You've got to check this bad boy out. Look at this. Alrighty then. Let's open this up. Let's see what I got here. Got a mouse, a uh, gaming mouse and keyboard. It says yeah, an M MF Tech gaming keyboard and mouse set. Three color crack backlit gaming keyboard. So let's go. Let's, let's take a look. Oh wow, folks, guys, oh seriously, that is lash. Check that out. Look at that! Yes, it's what is 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 a wired mouse and keyboard. I prefer wireless, as my mouse and keyboard is here right now. These are a wireless mouse and keyboard I got here. But hey, for something like like this, I sacrificed the the wireless. I also got a mouse. I got a mouse mat with this. Okay. And also then, the main part, look at this, look at this, folks, wow, look at that, that is, but guys, honestly, I swear to God, that is wicked, oh wow. Oh, he's even got my multi-keys as well. So I can um, stop, play and pause my music, skip it, whatever. This is awesome. Guys, so this is all I got uh, for the for the unboxing. I'll create separate videos on how to set this stuff up and get it working and show you guys. So my name is Chris. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video.